Hello, my name is John Lyle. I'm a designer. I have a collection of high-end furniture that I manufacture. And I want to tell you a little bit about that, the materials I work with, and how to see more of the product. Here we go. Let me tell you a little bit about bronze. Bronze was my first love and the very first material I worked in. We work in both yellow bronze and white bronze. Yellow bronze is yellow because it has a lot of copper in the alloy. White bronze is white because it has a lot of nickel in the alloy. We can cast with these materials, fabricate, and forge. Casting is where we melt the material, pour it into a mold. Fabricating is where we take a sheet of the material, cut it into a shape, fold it, and weld it to create a volumetric design. And forging is the old-fashioned blacksmith method. The metal is heated and hammered into a shape. Once we get the metal into one of these forms, we can add patina or polish. For the patina, we can do that with the yellow bronze. And the patina can be achieved to be any color that you've seen on a piece of sculpture in a museum or an art gallery. With white bronze, we can bring it to a high mirror finish or put a luxurious matte finish on the piece. I love chagrin and it has a great history. It was used by the Egyptians, by the samurai, and the court of Louis XIV. In the 20th century, it was used by Art Deco designers and Carl Springer as early as the 1970s. I continue that tradition with the chagrin I use. And what's special about our chagrin is the sheer size of the skins, and we use natural dyes to color them. That allows the natural beauty of the material to shine through. What's lacquered linen? Well, it's just what it sounds like. Linen adhered to a substrate. We laminate a carcass with linen, and then we lacquer it. With this method, we can hit any color you pick dead on. Send me a Pantone color. Send me a Benjamin Moore color. Send me your favorite sweater or nail polish. I can hit that, and I can control the sheen. This is also very kid-friendly. Cleans up very easily. Here are some examples of some of the pieces I have interpreted in lacquered linen. When you look at these pieces, think they could also be interpreted in chagrin, seashell, or parchment. Let your mind wander. Morph these shapes. Make it your own. I also offer a beautiful collection of pieces fabricated in stainless steel. We can do a mirror polish finish or a matte finish on stainless steel. I love working in seashell. Mother of pearl, black mother of pearl, black seashell, and pin shell. Do you know pin shell? Pin shell is like the politically correct tortoise. Looks a lot like tortoise, but it's not endangered. The mother of pearl we use is Tahitian. It's the highest quality mother of pearl available in the market. With the shell, we can either lay it out in these crackle triangle pattern, or we could do it in a brick pattern, like we do our bone. Cow bone is a byproduct of the meat industry, bleached cow bone. We use it both to trim our pieces and to create entire pieces. It can be laid out in a variety of ways. What is parchment? Parchment is goat skin. You may have also heard it called vellum. We can bleach it or we can make it look like the antique parchment you've seen from works from Jean Dunant. On this William chest of drawers, we have combined bleached parchment and walnut. Great combo. The Elizabeth Buffet is made with parchment, black seashell, bronze, and walnut. Take a look inside of the drawers. That's where we really show off what we can do. Hey, have you seen some of these pieces in tobacco leaf, sometimes trimmed in cow bone? Tobacco leaf is such a wonderful material. It's natural, like many of the other materials I work with. We use real tobacco leaves on our furniture. I've used it in gentlemen's cigar rooms, on tables and cocktail tables and end tables. It's a dark, amber-rich color, and the veining is beautiful. Take a look at some of these andirons, fire tools, and fire screens. I feel the hearth should sparkle all year long, even when there isn't a fire in the fireplace. Take a look at some of these case goods. 
and then try to imagine it in the various materials I offer, whether it's chagrin, lacquered linen, seashell, or parchment. What is special about my outdoor furniture? Number one, we use very heavy mahogany to construct the furniture. And mahogany is the best wood for outdoor use. Number two, we use a marine grade yacht paint to color and cover the mahogany. And that paint is suitable for use outdoors all year long, even on a beach, in the snow or in the shade. We can hit any color you want dead on and control the sheen from flat to high gloss. To learn more about the collection, visit our website at www.johnlyledesign.com. There you can learn about all of our products, finishes, and you can download a tear sheet of any of our products. You can also learn a little bit about who we are and where our showrooms are located. Also, be sure to log in. The username is designer and the password is designer as well. Once you have logged in, you can see and download our price list as well as our terms and conditions. You might be interested in seeing our other brands, which include Inox New York and John Lyle Create. Thank you for watching my first video. Here comes a slideshow of more product. I hope you like it. Thanks much.